I'm sorry. I was taking the um. Uh, Y'all yeah, see the video? Yeah. This fucking gash. Yeah, seventh grade, seventh grade, seventh grade. I think that's seventh grade. Seventh grade, fucking the worst. Seventh grade, yeah. I know what you do. No, I don't trust you. I don't trust you. I don't trust you. I do. So what? Bring back your little perm that you said, nigga. Yeah, shit was bad. Hold on. Shit, hold on. I saw one, bro. It was bad. We were throwing donuts. We weren't even doing donuts. We were just acting like we were throwing donuts. In Brian's truck? Yeah. Nah, it was in my, my little house. Oh. You remember Brill? Yeah. I wonder what happened to her. She got like two babies now. What do you mean she got two babies? Yeah. Stop it. Dead ass? She got, I know she had one for sure. I know her sister. I think you got her mixed. Gabrielle Casaberry. Uh, oh, she shit. She sure do got a kid like a hoe. Yep. Damn. You remember, you remember we, uh, from Miss, Miss, Miss Britt's class, we went rolling from all the way from Britt's class. <laughs> <laughs> way. I didn't even know she was a mommy for real. Look, <laughs> Damn. Oh, shit. God damn, boy. I don't know why I just started going through this shit. I just, um, we crashed into each other, I think. I don't know. <laughs> 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 there was another one. This, you gotta see this one. Bro. He was taking shit at the water burger. <laughs> Man, bro. And I, <laughs> I caught you. You just got to see your face, uh huh? God damn, bro. Look. Damn. God damn, boy. Damn it, you fuck. <laughs> Hold on, Kai. 
Hey, if you gotta go, you can go. Ah, uh, uh, nigga, I ain't gotta go. I just gotta hop in this little Madden game. I didn't know this bitch. I'm paying attention to you and this bitch. I didn't even know she had a fucking kid. <laughs> <laughs> when I got condoms, nigga, that's when I got condoms for the first time, first but I didn't even know how to use shit. Condoms, me, you, personally, and personally, we had we had gone out here to the uh, B-dubs. Mm-hmm. And I we get there. And then you stink up Bradley's bathroom or Brandon's. Stomach and shit with her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here it is. Here it is. Little <laughs> times, nigga. Fuck. You would have seen that. We got him with a tornado. That's the perfect place. <laughs> 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 I've been tired of that video. <laughs> oh, this nigga's in the phone. Oh, who is that? Who is that? Is that PC? Oh, my God. This nigga's in the phone. Nah, send me that bitch. Nigga, I'm for the first choice of that nigga. Fuck. school that one year? You remember what I'm talking about? <laughs> yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Bro, that shit was so funny. I remember. Nigga, I didn't even... <laughs> I was just like, hey! I mean, I thought nigga said he ran out that shit so fast, bro. Oh my fucking God, bro. That shit was so fucking funny. Hey, he took a video. I think things daily ran out. Then that um that white nigga came in. He was like, he was like, what happened? I said, whoever just was in here, take a video of me. All the time, all the time, I'm over here trolling this shit. I thought, I, I, and then that nigga said, when it came, he was like, it was your homeboy who did that shit. You know that? I said, no, I can't even get that nigga in trouble. Bro, no, because I was panicking. I, I deleted this shit straight off as soon as soon as you screamed. That's a goal if I started to delete. Because like, we didn't know I was going to get you in trouble if it was you. I was just saying that bitch trouble. I said I felt like a victim and shit. He said Stanley. <laughs> I didn't go. Stanley was the one who took the bitch. I said, hell no. Nah, I, I don't even think it was Stanley. You sure it wasn't Stanley? <laughs> oh, my God. Then he brought me into that room talking about yeah, things fucked shit up. took me for that, like, 35 minutes. Oh, my God. I wish we had that fucking video. Man. That shit is fucking in stories. But it was bad because you ain't had nothing. No, bro, nigga, I was butt fucking naked, bro. That was the crazy part. Like, nigga, I was butt fucking naked on fucking school ground, bro. <laughs> nigga, you could have asked to go to the nurse. You could have asked to go to the nah, because I was with Mr. Moreno. I was acting like a little bitch talking about we can't go to the fucking nurse office and take a shit. I was like, nigga, I ain't finna, I ain't finna shit. Like, fuck, I had to shit. Like, I had to shit. Oh, my God, bro. Where the fuck did Todd go? Yeah. Oh yeah, she in a military store, right? Yeah, she's she's about to have a baby. 
she don't got one already. Oh, she means, nigga, what the fuck is with you? Your <laughs> bitch is getting pregnant, man. What the fuck? You infertile, bitch. <laughs> yeah, she got a whole man. They probably get married soon. And she like that with baby. I don't like the sound of that shit. What the fuck you mean she got a man? She bugged down everything. Who that is? That's a young. Stop the seas class, I go in. Oh, yeah, that's you. So, what you been doing? You just been living it up over there? Nigga, it ain't really much living, nigga. It's fucking death every fucking day, bro. What, uh, yes, bro. Like, the workouts. Yes, bro, the workouts is the bitch. I got class and shit. But the good thing is, good thing is, them niggas gave me an iPad. <laughs> yeah, look. What the fuck you need an iPad for? I mean, to, like, watch plays and shit like that. Like, this is, like, basically my personal iPad now. So, like, I can do whatever the fuck I want with it. Unless if I transfer. Like, Nigga, this day, you remember this day? I was like, oh, I could not stop laughing. Gina fucking Manasco. We got Gina fucking two years straight. Each year I feel like each year I feel like we just got fucking worse. <laughs> Nigga, why are you leaving for El Salvador? That shit hurt when you bend it. Yeah. Right, that shit hurts, man. Yeah. If it was, you would, you would, you can't really sprain your ACL so much either. It's, it's like a, like a great one. Yeah. Like, 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 yeah, nigga, um, I, I really think you should have probably got the pizza. Yeah, but I wanted to get, uh, I wanted to get some place. Yeah, some good special teams coverage as they bring him down. He's just outside of the 15. So they did an extra. Two weeks, so he didn't feel any better. Couldn't get an MRI. So. Why the hell, nigga, if you, an extra MRI is the same shit. No, an extra is just the ball. The MRI is 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 the ball. Why the fuck they didn't do the MRI first? You can't, I mean, if you break your fucking knee on an x-ray, nigga, I mean, you gonna feel that, bitch. I mean, yeah, when you get ACL, you ain't gonna really have no fucking broken bones. Who, who was it anyway? Yeah, I mean, you, you probably should just go down to some care or some shit like that. I mean, I'm, I'm going to tell you like this, if your ACL is torn, the kids going to that bitch is looking for the number. Yeah. It's like a it's like a full year recovery kind of shit. Yeah. Oh, sure. yeah. 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 Yeah
I'm trying to keep strong, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like minor setback, major comeback kind of shit. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. Trust me. Yeah. He's like, I'll get that on you. You gotta prepare for me. Yeah. 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 So you yeah. yeah, looking at the video, bro. Bro, bro. You been hanging with Jalen in that mix? Uh, not too much. I haven't really been hanging with nobody. Really. Like, yeah, yeah. Like, that nigga Jalen did into some crazy shit, like cocaine and shit like that. What the fuck you talking about? This nigga been fucking drug dealing cocaine and all this weird shit. They gotta leave and niggas just go fucking crazy, huh? <clears throat> but, yeah, I did some chill about myself. I feel it. Uh, I'm kind of mad how this, like, this year kind of went. Why? Because we, we really didn't end it off from like the best shit, you know what I'm saying? Like the unforgettable shit. Honestly, nigga, I, the way how I wanted this year to end, it didn't end the way I wanted that shit to end. Yeah. I really wanted to kiss Grace Spooler. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Don't she got a band? Yes, bro. She got a whole fucking man, bro. He was looking pretty bad that day. I saw her. Oh, nigga, I hate the fact that she got a man. That should be eating me up sometimes. It could have been us versus the world. Why didn't you ever get where? Now, because Elise fucked that up. Elise fucking posted some shit, and bro, till this day, nigga, I'm still mad about the shit. Even though I got a whole happy fucking relationship, I still get mad about that shit till this day. What Elise post? It was like a happy boyfriend day, and we weren't together on some shit. Oh, that's that's fuck. And Grace, like, someone sent it to Grace, and was like, "What the fuck is this?" And I was like, "I was like, damn." You can't really explain. Yeah, that. and I can't even explain that shit because it's like. Like, I was trying to tell her, like, I ain't even trying to, like, play with your ass. I mean, so dead ass. She was like, she was like, kind of don't fuck with me. Like, she cussed me out and everything. I'm telling you, nigga, high school moment when great, when great school, he cussed me out in the fucking senior parking lot. Nigga, I can never forget that shit. Told me that wasn't work shit, worth her time. I was like, I'm worth your time now. No, like, that shit's twisted. Hey. And then, I mean, a couple weeks later, like, I was like, can we talk? And I cleared up the whole thing. But then, like, by then, she was kind of, like, over my shit. I don't blame her. Like, like the thing about it is, nigga, we didn't, I didn't learn a single fucking lesson. No. Like, shit. It was, fucking, it was young and fucking dumb. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, Man, I'd never forget high school, boy. High, if, any, if one thing high school ever taught me was, when it, when it was... Bitches ain't shit, and, and I ain't shit with them bitches either. That is one thing high school would always teach me, bro. Like, that is the one thing I learned from fucking high school. Everybody be doing the same shit unless you really find you a good one. If you think you ain't there doing shit, no, you not. You really fucking not. That bitch could be doing the same shit, but she's playing the fuck out of you. Look at me, yo. I got played to the point. I got played so bad sometimes that, nigga, I I have to check myself. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, I've been played. Yeah, nigga, y'all niggas are whole ass niggas for this shit. What's your crazy? What's so crazy was, bro, if I dead ass really would have locked, I could have fucked with Ava in all high school if I wanted to. There was a few opportunities there. I just, I don't know. This would be some shit I just don't be giving a fuck about. The memory's good, bro, but then, like, I mean, the good. Now, I would say this though. I would say I would tell you this, dude. College, yeah, college ain't no joke, dude. You thought you thought high school was bad, nigga. 
College is just a bigger fucking playing field with just a whole bunch of pussy all over the damn place. Right I'm not going to get it there, man. Even, even if I got a full ride, I would be Nah, nigga, don't do that. Don't do that shit. I regret doing this shit. Let me tell you what. I'm going to be doing shit. You're like, it was just cool. Number two. You probably ain't going to earn Jack's shit just like how you didn't earn Jack's shit in high school. You probably going to earn some life lessons. Nah, nah, but I, I feel what you're saying, but on a on a real note though, since I'm going for a business finance degree, I do learn something new every day. Bro, my brother graduated from business finance, but they can't learn shit. You know, me, Do you hear the nigga you're talking about? Carlos? <laughs> like, you know that nigga ain't give a fuck? That nigga's smart. I tell you that. That nigga's smart. But Number two, this is pussy laid out all over the fucking place. You ain't gonna be able to focus. Uh, oh, but here, here's, here's the crazy part, though. So, here's how it is. So, right now, it's just all the football. Just football. It's, it's just all football. Right now. So, all the white bitches start getting in there. You're gonna get fucked. Oh, nigga, I'm already knowing, bro. Like, so, like, here's how it is. So, here's how it's measured out. So, all the football niggas are basically you. Like, we're by ourselves. We a bunch of hungry, horny ass niggas. <laughs> like, that's literally what it is, niggas. Niggas are just fucking horny. Now, think about it. You got the pom- you got the Palm Squad that still be here. Then you got the, um, like, the Palm Squad is the only bitches that actually stays around here. Like, everybody else gone. Like, women's soccer, men's soccer, um, like, everybody gone. So, at the end of June, around the end of June, that's like when we, when we leaving for Fourth of July, kind of that's when everybody starts making their way back. In. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like, like I'm talking about the women now. The women coming back, you know, you know where that comes to. You know, niggas gonna be horny and shit. So then, like, when we get back from Fourth of July, we're gonna have some bitches here. But at the end of the day, it's really like. At that point, either you're going to be horny as fuck when them bitches get back, or you're going to be like, chillin'. Not me. Well, to be honest with you, I don't think you're going to make this, man. I'm going to be fine. I don't really think so. But, like, the thing about it, too, is, like, if you say you play football, pussy is really easy. <laughs> hey, <laughs> yeah, that shit is really easy to get, bro. I don't say you make it. I don't know. I said you. That's my point. I don't know. Hell no, nah, I, I don't I don't think I'll fall so easy. It, it got to be something on the line. Nigga, you you see how many bad bitches. I'm talking about bad bitches. I'm talking about you got it all laid out. You pick where the fuck you want. Shit. They'll be in the RB. Nigga, I get SKDs down there. I'll tell you that. That's the shit, though. That's the, shit. That's, that's the kind of um, game that you play with some of these niggas. <laughs> <laughs> you got a thing, nigga, like. I'll chop my balls up and throw buckets, guys. Ah, that shit, that shit. Come on. I never want my teammates passing out on a bitch. Yeah. That's normal. Yeah. That's that's a really, that's a little bit of normal. And then like another thing too, like if you ain't fucking no bitch without no condom here, nigga. That's your that's your risk, nigga. I've learned that as well. Like, it ain't gonna be on some whole shit either. It just be that's just how it is, bro. So like even if I did have sex with somebody, I would have to wear a condom. Yeah, no, nah, she big stand. I don't, I don't wear those, nigga. I go in raw. <laughs> we know. <laughs> you know, nigga. Trust, we know. Man, you, you remember that man situation, nigga? That, I don't man. really dead ass think you have a kid. I do too. Like, I'm so serious. I think that's my that, kid. Like, dead ass. Like, I remember telling Cameron that shit. She was like, Stanley has a son. A, what is it? A son, right? Daughter. A daughter, yeah. 
She's like, yeah, because I sure was a daughter. I was like, I was like, yeah, Stanley got a whole kid. She was like, huh? I was like, yeah, but at the same time, we really don't know if it's his. But at the same time, it is it, his. Ain't no way she asked me for paternity test. All this shit. And she's still texting me to the day. I'm telling you, bro, she's going to play a little game with you, watch. Hey, my birthday, my birthday is six days. She's gonna hit me with that child support by some of these. She's gonna hit you with some shit. Now, I couldn't tell you what that some shit was, but. It's gonna be something. She's gonna hit you with some. It ain't even gonna be like. It ain't even gonna be something that she's gonna be expecting. That shit is gonna catch you off guard. She's gonna be like. The fuck around that kid is yours. He's gonna be like, whole lot. Keep your money for that job, bro. Not really, because then that's the case. Because you could, I could take that. Okay. I mean, you could just. I mean, yeah, I could. I mean, I know I'm probably winning. You won't hear me out. Here's why you won't win. Because you in contact with that bitch. I don't know, but I mean, I guess. But then at the same time, she knew how old I was, and then well, I said, "Cause you, it's your fault, nigga. You told her I was 16. This wasn't my fault, nigga. Don't try to blame me and bring me into y'all fucking love triangle fest with this fucking kid. Y'all got me fucked up. I ain't tell you shit. I ain't tell you to fuck the bitch. I sure was in that motherfucker's school. I just said you were 16. That's all I said. You all know that girl. All right. You told the bitch that you you were the one who wanted to make that big boy move. It's bad. We live and we learn, nigga. I'm finna I'm finna let you go. I'm gonna take star out and walk. Clear my mind for a little bit. Alright, little man. It was nice talking to you. Ah boy. Ah, love you too, nigga.
So they accept the penalty, of course, and push the offense backwards a bit. Another attempt now from five yards further back. It's good, and it is now 21-7. kick is away and here comes a return from just beyond the goal line and yeah, he'll be brought down shy of the 20 so the decision to bring it out of the end zone not a good one the Dallas offense here set to begin the drive I remember they were just out here a moment ago through the pick six, so we'll see if they can take better care of the football this go around. Yeah, and sometimes, partner, I think it's almost better. Oh, right on the heels of the pick six, another ball intercepted. Picked off by Reed Blankenship. And the Eagles are going to have the short field here as they'll take over right at the 50. They exited the pocket trying to improvise. That was a tough throw, and unfortunately, it wound up in the wrong pair of hands. And Brandon, when you're on the run, sometimes your downfield vision can get skewed just a bit. Now, the beauty of extending a play is sometimes your receivers find their way open, but oftentimes you end up closing down part of the field and bringing those defenders to the ball, and that one was picked off. Now, a nice play defensively on first down as this is knocked away and incomplete. From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. And the Cowboys pressure gets there this time for the sack. Osa Odigizawa able to disrupt yet another pass play. That is his third sack of the afternoon. So after that sack, Hurts and the Eagles, tough spot here, third and long. They'll let the QB keep it here off the option. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. A real letdown defensively. That was third and a bundle. But they allow the conversion. Well, he is certainly dangerous when he spots a lane and he keeps it himself there. Worked out well. How about the moving parts on a play like this? You know you have to practice it over and over because it's almost like a ballet that has to be choreographed. But how about once he made the decision to go, he committed to it and went. Let's face it. Most teams are going to defend the running back much more than the quarterback on that type of a play. Throw right side caught by Goddard, the tight end. And now it looks like they're going to be in the hurry up. From the gun, it's Hurts. Nowhere to go here. He lost the football. It's picked up by the Cowboys. And his guys are going to get the football at their own 47 yard line. So potentially a turning point here in the third quarter as that swings the door back open just a bit. Yeah, they're still down two scores, but I do think we're at that point in the game. We're going to reach for the football whenever possible. You're going to hear the coaches scream from the sidelines. Tackle him. Second guy in. Tackle the ball. Eluding the pressure right. It won't be a sack, but it's no gain, and it brings up second down. He certainly did his best to find something on that run, but there just wasn't enough time to make it happen. Nice effort there, avoiding the sack and getting back to the line of scrimmage. That one certainly could have ended up worse. deep shot that's complete and they're able to work this to the 25 before it's all said and done Prescott looks to throw on first got a man on the right sideline that's Ferguson two big plays in succession not sure this D knows what hit him but now they got to get ready it's first and goal Pollard will take it up the gut and he'll be stopped just outside the five at the six light of today reflect that he is now getting into the end zone two times look at you you little uh ralph waldo emerson is that his name 
not just going with the meteorologist. Said it was a day game. I'm here. The extra point up and good by Aubrey. And they won't be able to run another play. Time has expired on this third quarter. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. And he'll elect not to run with it. And a fair catch will move this out to the 25-yard line. offense sent to begin their next drive now Charles of course you got to remember last possession they fumbled it led to a touchdown one score game here got to be careful and this is where coaching and training really comes into play doesn't it what, do we, what does everyone say after an hour next play move on next drive that man tries to come to the front they got to take care of business right here and act like the last series just didn't happen now it's second and ten left, it's Hurts. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. And that'll go for a gain of 18 on the keeper. First down. Hurts. And he will go down. A Cowboys sack. And quickly, they get to the line. Throwing on second and long. Well, that'll be incomplete. Well, he took a shot as he let that go. And it's going to bring up a third down. Throwing his hurts. He'll drop this one off to Swift. And he'll be brought down right around the 37. He did his best to just get four out of that, but not enough. And now fourth down. The Eagles send out their punter now. And surprisingly, this is the first punt of the game for either team. And the play clock is going to run out here. They're in no hurry to get a playoff. Now the offense knew it. They were already starting to walk back as that one is accepted. The Eagles send out their punter now as he's on to punt for the first time this afternoon. There he goes, right side. Touchdown. Turned 69 yards. And the Cowboys are an extra point away from tying this game here on the fourth. And that jumps the excitement level up a few notches, doesn't it? What a big time punt return for a touchdown. Now their cohorts on the special team side, they've got to add the PAT. That would be the equalizer. Don't forget the extra point. It's up and good. And partner, we've got a tie game here on the fourth. <laughs> Young, too funny, bro. God damn. What's the word? What is it looking like? <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm gonna win this shit. I'm gonna win this shit. Got me fucked up. Oh. Fuck. Bro, I can't. I got my head hurting. My fault. We yelling too loud and shit? Already at the line, this Philly offense set to go. Well, they just gave up the score to tie it. That's the bad news. The good news, plenty of time in this fourth quarter to try to grab that lead back. And officially, no gain on the play, and it's second down. Absolutely love the effort there. The ability to throw from his inside spot and stop that one at the line of scrimmage. That's what you want me to get you? Backer play. Yes! Yes! <laughs> I don't think you understand, Cameron. 
I lost to Kyrie eight to fucking sixteen. Well, Come on, the let's go. Run this shit. I already know what the route he runs. Come on, give me a pick. Pick right. Pick. Yes, yes, Kyrie. Yes, let's go, nigga. Come on, wake the fuck up, Kyrie. Wake the fuck up. Come on. Ball game of the fourth quarter. Games are this close, it usually comes down to the team making the fewest mistakes, and that was one of our mantras back at Tennessee. Coach Major say all the time, the team making the fewest mistakes okay. will win. Hold on. Good first down. Good first down. Five yards on the scramble, and that's enough to pick up the first. I wish we were on the phone. Where did it move? So I wish we was on the phone. Get in! I ain't your bitch ass talk shit, nigga. Shut the fuck up. So Jordan was here earlier, right? And like he like got us food and shit. And um I was like I was like, Jordan, you sleeping? And he, like he was like his girlfriend was like, nah, but I'm kicking him out tomorrow. And I was like, I was like, well thank the fucking Lord we at least get Jordan back for twenty four fucking hours. So after the touchdown, Aubrey now to kick yeah. this one away. But no one back yeah, here. it's literally right down there. That's my nigga, but he missing my nigga sometimes when I be about to go to see him. First and ten. Hey, let's go. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. And he'll be out of bounds. Yeah. No, I'm 28. Damn it, I was just down 21 to fucking 7 like 5 minutes ago. And I said, I was like, hold on, camera. I need to lock in real quick. Extra opportunity to move the ball downfield. Very smart football. You know this, camera. Here's a you know it gets serious when I start locking in. I gotta tell you this. Hold on. Oh God, they're absolute Jesus. Hey. You be snake. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, nigga. That's it, dead. And holding it may be the wrong decision. What color I want my what to be? Here comes second down. Yo, yo, pussy color. Hey, 73, 73. Beach. Look to throw. <laughs> Told you, nigga. Picked up by Malik Hooker, and he's able to get it back to the 41 yard line. We couldn't ask for much more to this point in the second half. White. Gorgeous day, one score game, first and two yeah. here. Yep. Yep. Here to start to drive as they connect left side. Wait. Color my beat. What's the normal color of a bird? Got here to throw. And this is caught. And that could seal it. It's a touchdown. Oh. No, I said fucking go in, bitch. I told you, nigga. I don't lose twice, nigga. What I say? What the fuck I say? What the fuck I say? Fuck around with this nigga. Oh, 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 o
This is first and ten. Okay. Your favorite color. So, um. Bert sets up to throw it. Yeah. Wait, no. Force, wait. Force, wait. We've seen this That's her favorite coach. In this game, offensive line unable to keep leverage, unable to keep people away, he facing makes a lot of pressure. Fortunate, fortunate, just to get rid of it. One of the reasons they're down is that inability, though, to stop the pressure. We saw another example of it there. Another throw on second down, and this one incomplete as well. Back to back incompletions, but we know this is definitely down territory. Time not on their side. I don't think they want to try and get the first down in two installments. I think they got to go and get it right here, right now. Yep. Fourth and ten. Cameron, I've completely held this nigga to 21 points in two fucking quarters. That's what the fuck I do. Like, that's what the fuck I do. I'm telling you, nigga, that shit ain't open. It's either a pick or that shit a drop. PA crosser, yep. Told you, nigga. Hey! 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 That's your game, nigga. Go ahead, nigga, wrap this shit up. Told you, nigga, I don't lose twice. Oh, yeah. I made that nigga quit! I made that nigga quit! I made that nigga
Hey, babe. Where'd you go? I'm in Bryce's room real quick. I'm helping him tang up his thing real quick. I'll be right back. Oh, yeah. Come on.